right, here we are at the Willamette River. You want to show them where we are? Those dogs we're, look like they're going to snack. We're under the St. John's Bridge. We have spectators cheering on their fellow wildlife. And I put our big jar in the river so the temperature matches. And I'm going to slowly tip out some of this water. And I'm going to add in some river water. They can get used to it. See how cloudy the river is? Alright, with their curious look. Check it out. They're all waking up, even the quiet, lazy guys. Oh, there's a quick guy. looked at me. Henry's going to take over. Just it a little bit so they can swim out if they want to. or 60 who made it. Look, little guys, here they go. They're checking out their new life. All right, Lou, give them a shush. We can send our pebbles to the stream too. There they go. All right, so we know, we know what's next. They need to find a spot in the pebbles down below to hide, finish up their yolk sack, and then, oh yeah, look. They're looking for insects already. All right, and next up, they're gonna start feeding on their own without that yolk sac anymore. Their belly's gonna close up. They're gonna start going backwards on the big old water slide. Right down there at Sabi Island, they're gonna meet the Columbia River. Then they're gonna go all the way down the Columbia. They're gonna go to the estuary, and their bodies are gonna change in their kidneys. They're going to flip around and they're going to be saltwater breathers. And then they'll get really big and when you're 16 years old, come back during the salmon run and wave because that'll be them coming back. Hopefully they don't try to get into MLC to lay their babies, but if they do, I'll open the door.